Uh, the ISRO chairman, Dr. Somnath, joins me on the phone line. Dr. Somnath, you know, we are seeing images of all of you celebrating. Give us a sense of what this means for you and your team. First of all, congratulations on behalf of the whole country. Thank you so much for your great surprise and congratulations. Thank you so much. What does this mean for you and your team? Just give us what you went through in the last few hours leading up to the actual landing, the mood amongst all of you. See, this is an event we were all waiting for last so many years. That you know, uh, it's a series of work that we have been doing to explore moon. And uh, it culminated with the touchdown today in the Chandrayaan 3. We started a journey uh, right in Chandrayaan 1 to understand moon. Fantastic findings came out of it including the discovery of water on the moon. Uh, then uh, Chandrayaan 2 gave a lot of uh, further scientific data and images. But we missed uh, the touchdown, soft touchdown narrowly in Chandrayaan 2, which we made up after four years of hard work. So it means they lost to the team because their morale to, uh, to achieve in the very first time uh, was shattered a bit. It has come back now. So they will be ready to take up more challenging uh, exploratory missions, more complex machine building as well as uh, going far away from moon for one day. I, I have to ask you this. Uh, did you have a sleepless night last night or were you uh, supremely confident that all was well? I slept very well yesterday night. <laughs> well, so, I, and all right through, you, you were extremely certain that nothing could go wrong. Give us, our viewers, a sense of what, what Chandrayaan 2's failure to have that soft landing uh, did you make all the corrections required to ensure that everything was smooth? Was there any uh, anything specific that you had to do? See, first thing is anything can go wrong in a mission like this. So we are fully con aware of those possibilities. And uh, the things that can go wrong is beyond our control. So there is nothing much we can do. But what we did in the whole of last many years is to understand what all things can possibly go wrong and how to mitigate that possibility of failure through other methods. So we discussed many, many ways by which a potential failure or multiple failures can be mitigated by alternate mission strategies. So we call it as development of different algorithms to handle contingencies. So in this mission, many such contingencies were incorporated, mm -hmm. uh, which was not there in Chandrayaan 2. But, un but fortunately, we could... Yes, go ahead. You, you are now hearing the clapping yes, of I'm, the I'm... Rover, ramp, ro rover ramp deployment. Oh, I see. Wow. So, you know, it, yeah. this clapping, you know, we are, we are seeing lots of images of your team. It's obviously a team effort. How many people, uh, 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 Dr. Somnath, were actually involved in this exercise? You want to tell us a little bit about your team? and Because this has been a great team effort and you are very generous in always, uh, you know, uh, always supporting your team, uh, giving them full support right through this. So, give us a sense of your team. Lots of women also part of your team, which is terrific. Yes, sir. Uh, my team uh, across ISRO centers, they, in fact, this work is not done at one center. It is a multi-center work. All my centers contributed in different ways to it. The ro launcher center built the rocket to launch it to the first orbit. So, it's a huge effort by four big centers. Then the satellite was built by another uh, about seven, eight centers, contributing in various uh, elements, instruments, propulsion, structures, uh, its uh, ground station network, the software, testing, so that way many, many centers participated. So I cannot count the exact number of people, but it must be 1,000 to 1,500 people directly and indirectly contributed to building this uh, mission. And, and you would say that this has been a four-year exercise that has culminated today, that this has been four years of hard work from Chandrayaan 2 to Chandrayaan 3. Am I correct? Correct, 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 yes. And, and anything you would like to tell the people of this country in conclusion? You know, you become yeah. a nice, you become a national hero, Mr. So uh, Dr. Somnath. I know that scientists, I don't, I know that scientists I don't Isro, like to Isro see themselves become, as. ISRO has become the hero. Yeah. Uh, uh, you're saying ISRO is the national hero. You want to tell us that again? Yes, sir. Yes, of course, ISRO is the national hero. I am just a part of it. You're just a part of it. Uh, when will the rover actually start uh, 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 moving? Is that ha going to happen now as we speak? Yeah, we are waiting for it. Many things have happened to make that uh, rover coming out. So we are in the process of doing it. One final so, question. Thank you so much. Thank well, one you. final, thank you one so final much. question. Your message to viewers, especially lots of young people who are today watching you, what would you like to tell them? 
I would like to make you believe in what we can do things in India. This is a 100% Indian made uh, mission. The rocket, the, the satellite, the sensors, the payloads, the instrumentation, the software, the programming, algorithm, everything is our own. Of course, we have some little bit of help from other people, but it is mostly an Indian effort, Indian engineering. I think we must all be proud of the capacity that we have, the ability that we have to conceive and complex mission execution. I think we are very proud of it. And you and the next generation should shoulder such high responsibilities and deliver for our nation. Sir, you know, wonderful words from you. I want to congratulate you, clap you for what you've achieved. Fantastic. On Thank behalf you. of every viewer of uh, this channel here today, every Indian, we are very proud of you and Team ISRO, uh, Dr. Somnath. You've Thank done you. the nation Thank proud. You. Thank you so much for taking Thank time off. So I know you're very busy, but taking time off.